is best for the city of Edmonton. We will have a brand new arena. This is about building a future for tomorrow, building a city that sees and wants its younger generation to see this as a place for them to build their tomorrows. We can build a city of heroes. We're encouraging all Edmontonians to make something, hence the name, Make Something Edmonton. People do come here and they start something, and I think that that's really infectious. The opening game here in Edmonton, 60,000 people, all wearing red. We can build a city of First inaugural yeah. flight to New York. Puts Edmontonians about four hours from United Airlines major hub. And let's not forget all the benefits associated with bringing New Yorkers to the Edmonton region. We can Entrepreneurism and innovation is just so essential. It's very much at the fabric, the DNA of the Edmonton brand. We've always said that Edmonton is full of talent. We're always focusing on solving local problems, but thinking about it from a global perspective. Now Edmonton's been amazing. We got great momentum. If people can go to lightthebridge.ca. The more stuff we can light up, I think the better. We can all feel proud as Edmontonians that we did something together. Major work will begin today on the Walterdale Bridge. We can build a city of heroes. A shout, a whisper, a call for love. We won't give up. We want it all tonight. We can build a city of heroes. A shout, a whisper, a call for love. A call for love. For love. See you in Canadian. Women's Open officially teed off this morning at the Royal Mayfair. So first of all, it's worldwide. There'll be uh, cyclists coming from around the world. It is truly an international event. The Edmonton International Airport announced today that Iceland Air will offer four direct flights every week. Welcome to E-Town. Welcome to E-Town. This is E-Town. We can build a Please welcome with open arms, Commander Chris Hotfield. I think what this has done is just stimulated Edmontonians, Albertans to come together and really share ideas. It is great to play with these guys. Thank you very much, John. It's just absolutely fantastic. It feels like the start of something big. The best place to film Freezer turned out to be Edmonton. This is a city of imagination and ideas, of hard work. We know what we're most proud of, and that should be our only standard as we continue building.